Pandora is rich in one natural resource, raving lunatics. I have long sought to discover what makes them tick, but all too often it ends up being a bomb they have eaten. This time, however, I have found the ideal specimen who won't explode. For this experiment to work, we will need to travel to a psychically neutral area of space. I have marked one on the galaxy map. Bring Sanctuary there, and we can begin. Matrix interface system, which will allow you to journey into our subject's special mind. I am being sent directly into someone's brain. This is all highly unlikely. Please don't hurt yourself trying to understand. Any sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from impossible nonsense. On you go. through the mind of a psycho. Usually something rusty and sharp. But what about their thoughts, their memories, their dreams? I have studied the psychos of Pandora for decades, and I believe they all share something in common. A single idea so powerful that it breaks any mind that contains it. I call it Valhalla. This is Krieg. He's a Crimson Raider, a friend, and most importantly for today, a psycho. Say hello, Krieg. Maggots wriggling down into the fester! Communication is not his strong suit, but yours wouldn't be either if your mind looked like his. As such, in order to get answers, we must seek them out ourselves. What is the origin of a psycho? What lies within Valhalla? We are about to find out.
Denial appeal pending. How does it look in there? This is the mind of a vicious predator. Janice, are you certain I am in the right place? I doubt I made a mistake. I do not usually do that. Why? What are you seeing? <laughs> War for the little flies who faster at the ground. This tracks. Fear not, Tannis. This is it. Wonderful. Never question me again. Now, see if you can make contact with Krieg's inner consciousness. You must find Valhalla. <laughs> Slavering jawbones rake fury across the traveling maw. <laughs> 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 Barrels of gore lie built upon the slaking ground. I hear you, beast! Jack and nail, grinding bones, grating roar, and a shiny host! I'm not gonna survive my friend here's welcoming party, but I've got a place we can talk. Come on in. I'm just on the other side. But back and forth cutting. Sorry about all that. The madman pretty much runs everything these days. The rest of the place is pretty messed up, but. He leaves me alone here, so you're safe for now. Shoot more, shop markers. Guns for every occasion. Welcome to my home, I guess. I'm not, um, really used to having guests around here. Who are you? I am known as Flack. And if you are not Krieg, then who are you? Well, I'm also Krieg. At least, I'm the part that remembers how to be more than a screaming murder machine. How did you even get in here? Tanner sent me on this strange journey to discover what causes psychos to be psychos. She calls it Vault Halla. Tannis, huh? Should have guessed. As for what makes the madman mad, I've wondered that myself. 
but I don't think he wants me to know. See that? If your so-called Vault Hala is anywhere, that's where it'll be. He's kept me out of there for as long as I can remember. Maybe you can sneak in, though. Worth a shot. No hang a salami! I'm a palindrome! Easy, man. Just looking around. Slice you through the ears! Yeah, yeah, we've got it, you drama queen. Uh, what I wouldn't give to be rid of this guy. You're my own saucy amputation! Good, we're on the same page. Maybe I'll just leave with the Vault Hunter. I doubt that is an option. Think about it. If Tannis can get you in here, she can probably get me out, right? Maybe put me in, like, a robot body? That'd be cool. At this point, though, as long as I don't have to deal with this guy anymore, I'd settle for being a lump in a mayonnaise jar. Hmm. Tannis, can you do that? Oh, absolutely. You can store a human mind on a memory card the size of a postage stamp. I have a drawer full. But, as requested, I will track down a mayonnaise jar. Hey, you hear that, man? All you gotta do is open up the door to Vault Hollow for our guest, and then you get what you always wanted. Me out of here. For good. Cut the chain link to razor ribbons! Let's dance the blades! Sounds like he's just as excited to be rid of me as I am to leave. All right, man. Where are the keys? Ruins astray! What do you mean you lost them? Of course. Look who I'm talking to. Polish the chalice! Shine a spittoon! Make mirrors of monsters! Okay. He's saying we gotta go through his... my... our brain and find the parts of this statue. We need a buzz axe, a gauntlet, and a mask. <laughs> the screaming can opener! Ah, an orb. What is its purpose? Chase the meaty man! It's milk bone. Huh. That's an old memory through there. Or at least it was before this guy had his way with it. Hope you're up for some weird stuff, Vault Hunter. <laughs> All right, man. What's first on this little scavenger hunt of yours? The judge's gavel. You heard him. The statue's buzz axe is in there somewhere. Let's go get it. Lilith sent us on a mission to assault a COV stronghold. Listen, you're probably in for a pretty violent ride here. You should gear up. There's a chest over there. Check it out. Starving for the butcher's call! He's excited to get that bug axe. Tanners, will this, ahem, sweet loot still function in the real space? Oh yes, they will remain perfectly functional, so long as you constantly concentrate on unbelieving in their non-impermanent anti-existence. Naturally. In fact, considering the Psycho's fixation on war, I would expect Vault Hala to be brimming with all sorts of weaponry. Something to look forward to. Well, guess we'd better get to it. Go on, no point in turning back now. Let's find that buzz axe. Calamitous slaughter! Do you 
use an archaic definition of the word awesome. Awesome. Okay, this is exactly what I was talking about. You are the worst. You're letting our mind go to shambles. Look at this place, it's a mess. Butchery for juicy weasels! <laughs> you and I have very different ideas of fun, man. Oh, rip the organs from their flesh pockets! Okay, he's really excited to start looking for that buzz axe. Let him know when you're ready to go. Yes, yes, I see. The flesh horn. Of course. It's so obvious. Really, man? Blow the flesh horn? You do know how that sounds. Lilith sent the Crimson Raiders on a number of missions, but I do not recall them being so meat centric. Alas, such is the fleeting nature of memory. Did you know that our minds reconstruct our memories?
I deserve this. Flesh horn. Spice up the fricassee! <laughs> Looks like he's giving you the honors. Now to see if the castle returns the call. <laughs> Rivers of viscera and slug rot! <laughs> Assault the meat castle! Rip it from the seams! Time to take the battle to them. <laughs> Spikes for their eyes and nails for their tongues. Uh, well, naturally. Deserve this. Is this all there is? Do you see? 
see me! 